Welcome to Save the Day. I'm your host, Chris Bridges. Today, we have our video game expert here today, Jacob Mashishka. How's it going, Jacob? I'm doing great. I'm really excited for this game. How are you, Chris? I'm doing fantastic. Well, what do you have for us today? Today, we have Rock Band 4. Rock Band 4. I was more of a Guitar Hero fan myself, jamming out with my mom on the vocals, my dad on the drums, and me just playing to my heart content on the guitar, spamming buttons. Yeah, I was like that when I was little. Actually, you know, I actually played the game. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I remember uh, Guitar Hero 3 was great. But um, yeah, it's been a long time. It's been like since like 2008 or 9 when Activision shut down Guitar Hero. Uh, I think a little while after that is when Rock, the Rock Band 3 came out. So it's been, it's been a long time. It's been some sad times. Well, how many songs are in this game today? There's over 1,500 songs with new ones being added throughout its life cycle, which is probably going to be a couple years of DLC. All previous DLC you owned will be in the um, new game, and I think all the songs from the old games that came with it are also in there. So it's, there's a lot of music, a lot of music, plus new music as well. So Does this, does this game bring anything new to the table, like uh, game mode or something? Yeah, uh, so there's a new freestyle mode. So when you're playing uh, a song, in the middle of the song, you'll get a little notification, and you can just, like, rock out to your heart's content. You can just, like, you know, spam the buttons, go crazy, be, like, the little rock star you always wanted to be. And, um, you know, it, there is, like, little things that tell you, like, where you should be rocking out, but, like, y so you get more points. But you can do whatever you want. You can just go crazy, break your guitar in half. <laughs> don't, don't, don't do that. Just, just don't. Well, talking about guitars, uh, what controllers can be used in this game? So you have, you know, your guitar, vocals, and drums, and um, all previous ones on 360 and PS3 will work on, you know, the new consoles respectively. And um, for eighty dollars, you'll get the game and an adapter, so those old ones can work because of the new input type, they had to have an adapter. And then um, for $130, you'll get a new controller in the game, and for $250, you'll get you know everything. Well, you may think this is a little pricey, but it is a big old chunk of, hot, uh, chunk of my childhood. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll definitely be picking it up <laughs> at some point. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, well, I played on the Wii, but what, does, what consoles does this come out on? Um, so yeah, the Wii 360, PS3, those ones probably just not powerful enough to um, support this new game. So it's only on Xbox One and PS4, um, releasing on October 6th. And uh, yeah, it's coming out soon. It's going to be great. You're going to get all those achievements. <laughs> well, this isn't a mass multiplayer game, but is there some sort of like pre-order bonus when you get the game? Yeah, you get 30 extra songs uh, to start off with, and I think Amazon has four more, so you get 34 if you pre-order off of Amazon. So it's great. New okay. songs. Well, this is, oh, thank you very much for coming, Jacob. And remember to pick up Rock Band October 6th. Uh, this is Chris Bridges and saying rock out. Rock out.